Hi everyone, and this is the second semi quarterfinal of World Senior Championships. Barry Peaches versus Patrick Wallace. So let's enjoy it. And it's a first for me in the commentary box with the 1977 United Kingdom champion, Patsy Fagan. Good afternoon, Patsy. Just a straightforward safety shot there from Patrick, just putting the white up on the black cushion. And I would just like to take this opportunity to thank everyone for the messages I've got on social media and that about. Uh, that's opened things up. Could be, what do you think, Patsy? Could be quite a tactical match, this. Looked like he played more white than thought. Very well played. Four. And perfect on the blue. Well, maybe it does go. He's played on it. Seven. Yeah, just enough room. If you hit the red. Just stunned over behind the red for the centre pocket. Okay. It looks nice and relaxed, Dennis. Yeah, so watch that match, Dennis. Michael made a great fight back, he did, yeah, played very well and uh, back over behind the ping again. 20. Keeping it nice and tidy. Good position here. Not so nothing, Dennis. No. 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 Kiss has spoiled it. The only possible. He knows he's missed that the minute he hit it. Yeah, he uh, was up, well, up straight well, away. Wow, Dennis, what's this? That's a great well. shot, Dennis. Great shot. Very good. Got a big bounce? Well, it's all right. Oh, he's played it with a lot of screw and came up. Yeah. Beautiful kiss on the pink. Oh, the kiss on the blue is going to spoil things. It was a good effort. It was only one red that he could have dropped on and he was on his way to landing on that. 14. Just a safety shot, but he's well, a long way short, not, not one of his better shots. He's left it a long way short. Uh, that was the problem there. He may have covered it, but I think Patrick can come off the cushion and pop this red. Just didn't judge it. That was a bit of a chance there. What? Looks like he couldn't play this better. Has it got the legs, Dennis? No, short again. Seven. Much better. Fourteen. Barry decided there to try and open up a few reds and this is a tricky one, as you can see from that picture. 
It's not in, Dennis. Mm -hmm. Barry Pinchers, 14. He's decided to play a safety shot, keep it tight. Can't blame him for that. Sprung out of that bunch. Mm, now he might. Oh, he played it well. That was an excellent shot. And. Oh, oh. Brilliant shot on the red. I missed the easy blue. Not a chance for Barry. One. That's finished a little awkward. Played it well, nicely on the red. Four. Soft screw, he's played a soft screw, held it nicely. Ten. No, he hasn't got the angle now, he's gone up too far. Well, he tried to cannon the reds, but he's made it more difficult. But this looks pretty good. Good cue ball. He's playing the safety shot just twice across on behind the black spot and they're wide up. Pretty decent safety shot. Oh, he's played this well. This is excellent. What a shot he's played there. Terrific safety. Yeah, you've read that straight away, Dennis. Just a little gentle one. Well, I'm surprised <sighs> he's gone like that. I really am. Oh Always had a result, Dennis. Yeah, not much Patrick could do there. Just touched up. Barry's trying to play a little snooker over behind the black, and he's played it very, very well. Wow. It's gone by. Oh my god, he said that so hard. Oh, <laughs> Dennis, he's played the cannon the red out. That's certainly asking a lot from that shot, it was. You don't see this very often. Oh, this is near, John. This is near. No, he's okay. got away with this one. He's hit it badly again. It's still a short match and first game is so important to get yourself on the board, get yourself settled and it'll be a big advantage to the player who wins the first frame. So there Played this well. No attempt at the pot. That's an excellent shot there. Well, Not didn't this get time. away with it this time. Cushion. But uh, a great chance to get back into the frame and uh, make it very close. One. 
not on anything great really, over screwed for the group. Playing the snooker. Putting all the balls on, snooker behind the yellow, so... That's why he's played the alternate shot, and that's a pretty good result by the looks of things. I don't understand this shot. I don't understand this shot, he's hit it so slow. Barry's tried to make sure of the red and missed, missed it by quite a margin. This is going up over the hole, but he's got a lot of cover here, Dennis, from, uh, from the blue and green and yellow, so... Oh, and it's gone on the cushion anyway. coming off the top cushion. Just putting the red up beside the brown. Not quite got it close enough to it. But still, it's good safety. Played it, played it well, he's got... No, still quite a bit of tension in this opening frame, which has still yet to be decided. And uh, the brown... Lovely pot there from Patrick. Well. I believe he'll be taking the he'll be taking the pink to get onto the yellow. And the, well, tense side, a bit nervous. Play that lovely. Just trying to leave the green nice yeah. angle so he can get to the brown. He really need to knock the brown out. Uh. Anything but straight on the brown. He's got a chance. Twelve. But he's come up a bit short. He'd probably play the safety shot now. Oh, he's mishit this. He didn't go for that pot at all. He's just played a really good safety shot. Put some distance between them. I think he's got away with this one. He hit that a little thinner than he intended. Whoever pots the brown should win the frame. Yeah, you would think that would be the case here. Barry only wanting two, Patrick wanting three. And kissed, but he's, he's got the snooker behind the pink, I believe. Foul, we miss. That'll be going back, so advantage all of a sudden. Patrick, Patrick Wallace. Wallace. Try number two. Can he hit it? Can he get it safe? He's hit it. And it's not bad because. No, he didn't try to putt that. He's just playing the brown up to the top cushion. Safe in his shot. There's no value in going for the putt. Barry's just played it over onto the onto the side cushion, retaining safety shot. He can play it that way, off the cushion, over into the middle of the bottom cushion, way right beyond the pink. Very good shot. Didn't get the snooker, but very good shot. It's a great effort. How's the cue ball? This oh. looks perfect. Oh. 
What a shot he's played here, by the way. Absolutely terrific. And this is a Nine. pressure pot now. And safely in the pocket. It's been a long, hard-fought frame. And Patrick Wallace, well, he'll be delighted. It's always nice if you can win a, a long frame like that. And it's the man from Dungannon that leads one frame to nil. Yes, Dennis, so I expect this one to, to be a tough one. And, uh, you know, there's a lot a lot of stake for these players. They love playing in these, uh, in these seniors' events. And they will put their all into it. They both give 100%. And it is, you know, a tense thing you... Patrick just playing a little drop in behind the black. I don't think he's got it, but uh, he's opened up the black, so it's opened up the game a bit. He was on it. And a very good try, but uh, it's he got so close, he's left it. Now can he settle yeah. down after that long opening frame? In fact, he had the angle to screw up. In fact, that red's available into both corners, so that was a bonus. Five. Six. He might be playing on that red just behind the back of the back of the pack now. Yeah, he's played on it and he's left the angle, so he could be screwing this in. Fourteen. Very good. Yes, developing into a nice little chance this for uh, for Patrick. Thirty. Just coming off the cushion, back over for the a red into the centre pocket. 37. Three Mike. Now Dennis, he's played on the single red. He'll be going on the black and hopefully he'll be leaving an angle on the black to go into the reds. That's what his intentions will be. 43. No. Isn't it amazing? Where's the pink going? Where's the pink? A little harder, it might have dropped in, but it's amazing. One. Yeah. Yeah, always worth risking that because he knew he had that one to the left as a bit of insurance. Nine. slight problem I see the two reds together to the left of the pink spot there there you go the red's Fine. nearly oh it's all right it's okay a little bit harder the red would have been in front of the black and I mean he could play the cannon on those two reds this time if he wanted I think you might be right then oh that's a delightful shot Yes, so for the blue. 28. <coughs> Played it very well. Good line, Blonde. Maybe the last red. I say that because it's blocking the pocket for the green into its natural. Yes, I believe you're right there, Dennis. I believe that's what he'd be, what he'd be doing off the last red. The only problem with that shot, 42. because the pink's so close to the pocket. Forty-nine. Played it perfect. Very good shot. P 
think it is. So we had worked that out. Ooh, this might sure. be on top of the other tennis. Oh, it's perfect. Oh, he's had a right result. No mistake. 50th. Just the brown now to leave Patrick wanting Snickers. It's been a terrific performance from Barry Pinches here because Patrick 70. was in, looked the firm favourite on a 40 odd break. He would have been disappointed 76. to have lost that very long opening frame, but he hasn't put a foot wrong here. Absolutely fantastic from Barry Pinches as he puffs his cheeks out. He'd be delighted and he levels his scores. It's one frame each. Right, Barry to break off in the third to get us uh, to get a start in the third frame. And it's played a nice break. Seems to be a good lint down behind the bottom cushion down behind the green. Played it well. Good speed on the white. Played it with a bit of safety in mind. Played on the black and a little bit of safety in mind. Could have left the red that he that he played, but uh, all is well. If it goes in, and it would be fairly safe if he misses. Oh, that was close. Playing the double onto the black, but it's safety as well. More safety than anything. I wouldn't be surprised if we uh, don't have one here. Not touching, so he has to play the red. Back behind the black, not the greatest shot he's ever played, but uh, still, still reasonably safe. Close, but no cigar. Oh, it's just a bit too tasty. Yeah. Unless this pink goes into the... Well played. Fact, it wouldn't be a bad time to cannon into the pink now with that red. Just played for the red, so... 13. Well, he has... Yeah, hit it well. Now he's got a pot of red in the middle. We'll leave the angle on the blue to go to go into the reds. Yeah, he needed to be straight to do that. So this is the position he had a few shots ago. And he couldn't have played it any better. That's a beautiful shot that Patrick's played there. You won't see a better split than that. Played that to perfection. Very unlucky, would have been very unlucky not to be on one. So, brilliant chance here now for Patrick. Yeah, he's applied at the red, but he's hit it too hard, and now he's on the side cushion, and he won't be. And he's in prime position. Yeah. Because getting this red out of the way clears the black into that corner as well. 39. Yeah, played it very well. Played it. 47. Yeah, he can put this one now and just cut it off the red onto the black and uh Oh no man's no man's land. Yeah, just putting the green over near the side cushion. Not perfectly placed, but but okay, okay. Uh, where's the red going to finish? Needs to hit the green. 
And it does. Well, he's missed it, and uh, it's not too bad, I suppose. Didn't have an easy save this shot. He's tried to play. He's tried to play the wide onto the top cushion. Got the double kiss, and now it's Barry's chance. One. Yes, Dennis. He's moved Nine. the green out with one of them shots before, so he's moved the green into it into a better position. That looks like the, the biggest save your Patrick has at the moment. But there you go. Flicked it. Flicked it with his wrist. Got a little bit of side Flicky. using the extension. Yeah, just flicked it. He just flicked a little bit of side yeah. on the cue ball there. Yes, you're right, Dennis, he did. Wow. Four. That's a game-winning shot. He's played it so well. Just needs one more red, and uh, yeah, we still don't miss many of them, do we, Dennis? But he can relax now. Forget about that. He's uh, he's played this very poorly, as he's he's up, and he's put up the red. So seventeen, very good. Always five. nice if you can clear the colours up. It's uh, little screw over to the, towards the green. Patrick with the rest. Quite a nice shot. Thirty-seven. Played it very well. A little top spin shot off two cushions onto the blue. A little bit of running 41. side. That's a little bit of right hand side he's put on that just to take him off the two cushion. Just a natural top spin shot. Knocking the pink over the middle pocket. 46. Need a little bit slow. Took your advice, Dennis. 52. A chance he didn't think he was going to get, but. That's a superb clearance from Patrick Wallace. He'll be absolutely delighted. And he gets himself into the lead. He lost the opening frame, but he's 2-0 in front now. So it's Patrick who makes a poor break-off shot. Hit it far too thin there. Came down the wrong side of the blue. Yeah, he did, and he's got to be unlucky here. He's so unlucky. He's played it so well, and the Reds come out in front of him. So, unlucky, Barry. Just played the green, just put it over into the middle oh, of the... Well, Dennis, he, he's hit that all wrong. I've got a feeling he might have hit the wrong ball. Yeah. Back out of commission at the moment. Uh, Barry's opened up the reds though. And played a really, really good shot as well. Excellent shot. I think he's just playing true to the pocket here. Just, you know, you don't want to get a kiss. Oh. No, he's missed it. It wasn't, wasn't a gimme. It wasn't an easy one. Yeah, he missed the cannon on that red, but he's still lovely now. He's on one of the ball colour, so he'll be happy with that. Don't know if he's thought about that. Maybe not. He's playing into the pack, then it's to open up the pink. What? Now he's played it slowly for the blue. Six. He has to go down the table and back up now to the red, so... Now that's...
that's that's the problem there. You gotta miss the brown going down and miss the yellow coming back up. So I put a bit of side on it, got out the other way. Middle of the table. Very good, very yeah. good. Excellent job. Barry's just playing the containing saving his shot here off the top cushion. He won't. He played it well, middle of the bottom cushion, making it very hard for, for Barry again. Uh, not no pace really, just off the top cushion and beyond the oh he's just playing the tape off the cushion. Not going off Barry. No, played it well. Just a containing shot again. Yeah, it's not so difficult this time over there. He's uh, he'll have a route back to bulk. He will from there, I think. Whoa. Excellent putt there from Barry. Oh, oh. that's a bad oh, miss from Barry. Seven. thick side and no damage done though oh it's tight nowhere near it no he's not that was a tough shot that was and he's he's left Patrick with half a chance here no he moved into that shot his body went forward into the shot caught it too full and uh, he's presented Barry with an excellent opportunity now They all look very easy, these shots, but it's years and years of... It's a little soft screw onto the pink Fifteen. again. Yeah. yeah, a little soft screw shot, just hold it for the head over here. Hide it for the blue. They're not as easy as they would be if the black was on the spot, it would make them slightly easier. 25. You have to hit him in with a bit of pace to get up for the pink and blue. He's playing top spin into the three reds off two cushions. Oh, he's missed it. That's what it looked like yeah, he was going to do when you see him getting down the queue with that top spin, Dennis. No. Yeah, he's went for it. Oh, pink is is there a gap there, Dennis? Yeah, he's played it, he's potted it, but he's not on anything, Dennis. Well, nothing nice anyway. The table, somewhere near the green spot. That's it, he's going down, he didn't hit it hard enough. He was hoping to get behind the, behind the yellow, but he's kept the green nicely in play. Oh. The Nothing there, Dennis. The yeah, he's played it well this time. Another thin one required here, otherwise he could go in off. In fact, now he wished the white had have gone in the pocket. Given Bar Barry a great opportunity, but Barry's, Barry's uh, left it short. So now he's got to make his way down and back up. It's a little stun run through with uh, and he's not got enough stun on it. And he just caught the edge of the angle, so that's... Uh, that's pretty good though. Barry Pinkers, six. Caught it too full again. Sorry. 
Harris just played the safety shot and played it well again. Very good. Yeah, good shot. Good shot there from Patrick. Just a containing shot. Just putting the red over on the side cushion there is a little bit of insurance. And, you know, it was always oh, going to happen, it? wasn't it? He, he thought, well, I mustn't hit this stick. And he gets down and he's missed it completely. That's it. Lovely yeah. shot. Just knocked the pink onto the other pocket. Very good. And just this red. So you just yeah. sense that this and there's only one snooker needed so Patrick will be coming back to the table. Five pinches, 13. And in it goes, so that's going to be two each. Yeah, we had a feeling this one was going to be close, Dennis, and uh, it looks like it is. It's going to be a thriller. Doesn't matter about the red. Patrick puts his cue on the table and he concedes. And Barry pinches. Well, we're all square. Two frames each, a puff of the cheeks. He'd be delighted. Barry breaks off with a very good break off shot. Lovely length on the point. Well, he missed that by a long way. That wasn't very good queuing. He might get a bit of help here with this little cannon. No, he's... He went through a little spell against uh, Michael Judge when he and it's up to Barry to take full advantage. Oh. oh, he's played on the single red. Thirteen. Yes, he played a cannon on, on that ball he did to lead the other one. He's left it quite good. It's silly and a little bit hampered, but it's still still quite nice. Well, I'm not sure. He deserves a bit of good fortune, and he hasn't really had it. That couldn't have been closer. Yes, yeah, extremely unlucky, but uh, Patrick has played his shot beautiful. That is not the easy shot to play for position. Played a full ball cannon, didn't get it, got a half ball cannon. So he's left a red in the middle, but uh, he's on it, but uh, it's not a gimme. Six. He did beautifully, did. stayed lovely and still on the shot. Oh, he's hit that beautiful oh where's this going yes Dennis he would have been happier 13. staying around uh, around here uh, those reds are okay for the black but well wow. it's incredible what can be missed out 15. there he had them all at his mercy Barry will take full advantage of that there. Oh, he's short again. Well, Play it well. Can I make it? Oh, no, he's missed that by a long way. Hang on. Hang on. He hasn't missed it yet.
Well, just trying to leave a little bit of angle on the pink to get onto those two reds behind the other two where the pink spot is. He's got it. Oh, he hasn't. He's missed it. Oh, it looked in for a minute. It should go in off the other red, if not direct. Well, it went in direct, and that's a oh, beautiful knuckle. Well, you couldn't ask for a better little game-winning chance, I mean. Oh, rather right, the red didn't play great. He wanted to be over near. So yeah, why do people love watching snooker players twitching? It's in. Got a long hard red now. Played it well, it's a good pot. Fifty. Swung it around with a bit of side as well, Dennis. He played it really well. He couldn't ha help maybe leaving the red over for where he did, but he still played it very well. A long way away, Dennis, but he's got a good weight here, Dennis. Well, he holds his hand up to apologise because... Patrick's hit this beautifully, has. Needs a kiss on the green. Oh. He's got it. Now, I don't know whether he's got the angle to get back up to the reds. Ah, he's tried to stun it off the cushion. Over stun it, cut it, cut the yellow. Ah, oh, doesn't want the angle. No, he's okay, played it well. well. He's, it was a difficult safety shot and he's played it well. He's moved the red, which is... Uh, he would have been short and he would have left it, so but the other reds caught into it and uh, Yeah, he played it that way, but he's overcut it, didn't go too near the fall. Played it really well, played it really well, hit it nice and full, knocked it up the table, put a bit of distance between them. I just got a little bit too much on it there, but it's still pretty good. Nothing there, Dan. Yeah. Oh, and you could see there he got a little bit of ball. unwanted side. That's why he missed the red by a long way. So any side will just swerve the ball. There's nothing there again. I'll tell oh, you, there'll missed. be something there the next time. Oh, because be full he'll be, ball. He'll be warned that he'll lose the frame if he misses it. Looks like he's playing it quite full. Played it full, yeah. Knocked the red of the table and hope for the best, really. It's a little bit of hoping not to leave it, but I'm afraid he's left it. One. He's hit it lovely. And he's got a nice little angle on the blue if it does go. Well, I think he's got. A lovely little bit of side on the ball just to bring it up. He doesn't want this stray. And it is. He's left it straight. He's a little bit unlucky. Oh. Yeah, he played it well, Dennis. Yeah, and it looks like uh, he's played quite a nice shot. Just a little, little bit short of pace, but uh, you know. Thirteen. Gonna need the extension. Yeah. Yeah, he's played it well. Just a bit. He's played it well. Funky. He's played it absolutely perfectly. Yeah. Played it off the two cushions. Another not way of doing it. That's okay. That's fine. And he has left it straight. So this is going to be just a little rolling job. And yes, the man from Dungannon has done a nice little clearance to go 3 2 in front. And if you're feeling a lot happier now, won't be delighted with the way he's playing, but he'll be happy enough. 3 2 up and uh, on his.
looks like a nice break off from from Patrick there nice speed down behind the green left nothing hanging out and this is um, already a little bit of trouble for Barry doesn't want to come too high on this looks like he's played it well if he, if he reaches and he does yeah very good well done Chris. Yeah, yeah he declared a foul, foul. on himself there did foul Patrick it wasn't so much a push it was more of a shove yeah yeah it was a bit like when he played behind the yellow that time Dennis we need a touching ball otherwise it's a stalemate and a re-rack oh this would be a re-rack this would be a re-rack yeah yeah and they're going nowhere here no, not, no one's going to try and force it so yeah best best result get him up set him up quickly and it looks like he did it's a very good break again down behind the green yeah not quite a snooker this time i don't think but uh barry's just playing the white onto the top cushion just a containing safety shot not gaining any advantage really corner pocket but it's just not a good enough angle to get back on the black so back with a slightly awkward frame again with two reds wants to hit this well he's got it perfectly behind the black man oh very close very close just a fraction short but um yeah you want the white closer to the cushion tight on the cushion well he didn't want the plant he got the white tight on the cushion and <laughs> he didn't want that red to go into the right middle pocket. No, that's, that's a very difficult no. shot to play that at the speed required. This is better. This is a lot better. Here he am. You've got to be careful with these. I mean, he did well, but he hasn't got it near the cushion, so... And there's another two up there. I think the record I remember doing a frame and there was 13 reds up the other end of the blue. That's what he's done. <coughs> oh, he's just dropping into the pack. It's the old Miss Q shot. In the side of the white and just knocking it onto the red. Got touching ball, so he's okay. He can come over and he must get this tight on the cushion this time. a tough shot it's in oh kiss the other one oh oh we hit it far too thick it'd have been better just playing it playing ball and cutting it in rather than stunning it Dennis you're dead right you're playing it with bottom that's very hard to cut that shot in with bottom on it he's played on the Whoa. pink and it's not great, Dennis. Oh, it's a wonderful shot. That is an absolute great shot. Under so much pressure. There you are, back for yeah. this time. Just a little screw back onto the yellow with brown. He's, he's got... Oh my God, he's missed the yellow now. Oh, this is a great opportunity now for Patrick. Yeah, 
Yeah, he had to take that to clear that Seven. pocket so that the green would be available. So. Now I showed against Michael Judge in the deciding frame under extreme pressure. No. Yes. Oh, yeah. 23. Just scraped in the back door, Dennis, the side door. <laughs> Just playing a little soft screw right beside the thing. Play this lovely, that's better, yeah, that's better. You hit that nice. Thirty-one. The vote going there, so the target's quite big. Now he's played for the plant, Dennis. No, no, just overcut it slightly. And it was. No, he's lost his cue action at the moment, has Barry? Yeah, he's missed one there, Dennis. He, he never looked like <laughs> missing those. Uh, Yes, Dennis, just just pressure, that's all. These guys are just wanting to do oh. so well in this tournament. Yes. Oh, he's missed it, Dennis. It's amazing, oh, just... Uh, now we well, now we know he wasn't. Couldn't do much except uh, just drop onto the side cushion. Well, I'm not sure about that, but uh, it's a bit heavy. it looks a bit heavy. Yeah. Cushion there. Now he's avoided that, and he'll settle for that. Yes, I think. Very good from that position. That was awkward. It's all about pace. Most of them got pushed up the other end of the table. There's still five of them up there. And that's not the best safety shot that... Barry has ever played. Well, one. And look where he's put the cue ball. As I say, he's struggling a bit with his cue action at the moment. He's yeah. Barry thought that uh, he thought that uh, his speed of shot, you know, was better than what it was. I said it's too thick though. Dennis, you know that is one of the hardest shots to play. So near the pocket, you've got to hit it so fine. And he... Well, he couldn't have played it any better. Oh. Uh, very good shot, Dennis. And trying to come all the way around the table. He's got every part of the shot wrong. Well, just one. Missed the black and luckily for him didn't get on the red well he's took the yellow out which is not in his favor but of course he's he's refused to try to play a safety shot and it's not a good one it's definitely not a good one well Keep the yellow on the cushion. He's cut it a little bit too far. Hope the bullet. What? But, uh, oh, he's left it. He's left it very awkward. He's coming off the ball cushion, but he could put himself in trouble here. He had no other shot available, but look at the shot that uh, Patrick can play now. 
A little thin one. How's the judgment? Oh, it's perfect. Isn't it? Oh, might have just slipped out. Oh, green's gone in. Oh, pack the ball as well. Played it well. Played it very well. Oh. There was just enough room there. Well, Patrick Wallace. Gets on the red, it's definitely over. Well, he's on it to extent. No. No. Apparently, he's got a play on now. It's not beyond his reach to get the two snookers, but having said that, he's dropped himself. Yeah, dead right, Dennis. And left Barry Snooker. It might be easy to hit, but. Well, he's angled him. <laughs> he angled him, Dennis. No, no, no. No, no, no we're near, Dennis. Normally so good at that type of shot, but he's yeah, he's in a comfortable position at the moment. He still likes to be going out to have a cup of tea. He's still coming up behind that black and blue, and he's just coming up a little bit short. That's the one he was after. Oh. Elbows. You know what I mean, Dennis. <laughs> <laughs> know exactly what you mean and Barry comes forward to congratulate his good friend Patrick Wallace he didn't really perform didn't Barry today both of them struggled a bit out there but I can tell you what the pressure was intense and Patrick Wallace will be over the moon that he's got himself into the semi-final of this year's Rocket World Seniors Championship he defeats Barry Pinches by 4-2 Paddy just step forward if you wouldn't mind That'll do nicely. Well, it wasn't the prettiest match, but never mind. Congratulations, you've made the semi-finals. Uh, thanks. Yeah, listen, sometimes it's all about the W, and, and that's the situation we got ourselves in today. Um, Barry's much better than that. Uh, I'd like to think I am too, but uh, it, it's funny. People at home don't really appreciate it. It's a, it's a very, very wet day today, and the table played so differently, and you don't really even think of that. I wasn't even mentally prepared for that. The table was a lot heavier. Uh, my hands were a lot sweatier and stickier, so I was struggling a little bit with that, but no excuses. You know, I played okay to go 2 1 up, and then I started to queue around the corner a wee bit, and uh, you don't feel too good when you start doing that, but I just dug in and was lucky enough to get the result. And occasionally we have seen matches where the players almost by accident drag each other down a little bit, and the, and the prize is big. You know, we, it's the final day of the season tomorrow. This is where everybody wants to be, as far as the seniors tour is concerned, is, is in contention to win the title. So yeah, there was a lot at stake today. A lot at stake, and when you're struggling with the conditions a wee bit, and you're struggling with your game, um, with everything that's at stake, it's, it's difficult. Eh? Plus, we're over 50s now on the over 40s tour so we're at that disadvantage as well but listen you just got to hang in there and i feel very very lucky that i've won and at least i've given myself a chance to play a bit better tomorrow you have because you've got to be in it to win it any preference whether you fancy ken or david and, and will you be watching the second match tonight uh, no, I'll be watching the Liverpool match tonight. Uh, the boys can uh, bash each other's brains in. Uh, very, very tough game. Ken's obviously a class act. Uh, same as Barry. I've known Ken for about 35 years. Um, he's a good friend. And, uh, uh, you know, he'd be slight favourite to beat David because of his experience. But uh, uh, make no mistake about it, David's a quality, quality player. And uh, if he plays well tonight, Ken will have his hands full.
Well, enjoy the match. I'm sure you'll get a text message or two, depending on how things unfold this evening. Well done, Paddy. I know it's been a, an emotional week so far. Congratulations. We'll see you for the semi-finals tomorrow. So that rounds up our coverage for this afternoon. But don't worry, we are back at seven o'clock to determine the last two places in the semi-finals this year. Jimmy White, the defending champion, taking on Darren Morgan. And then we conclude with David Lilly against Ken Doherty. Ken coming up just short last summer. We're back very soon. The drama builds. Paddy Wallace and Igor Figueredo are through to the semi-finals. Join us at seven to find out who'll be joining them. Well, congratulations, Patrick Wallace. And he, has, he got a great comeback here. When Barry Pinches let in uh not not really that yes he played better and he he got the lead two one then three two and four two and this match with a winning so he comes to the semi finals and his opponent will be Kendo Hitsi or David Liley. So let's wait to let now to see who will be the winner of two last quarterfinal. Thank you so much for watching and see you guys in the next match. Bye bye.